Yo, dude. What's up with y'all, man? CJ back at it with another one. Y'all ain't see me in a little minute. I know y'all miss me. We're in 2023 now, man. It's a new year. I ain't even been on my YouTube shit, so we trying to get back at it, man. Today's video, we got a little unboxing. Um, I already know what it is. Some new clippers I ordered, so we're going to get right into it, man. Y'all going to see what's up. You gonna see what we got. Um, I'm also planning on showing y'all my basement. I made a little setup. As y'all can see, I'm in my room now. There's no, there's no chair, none of that in here, bro. I took all that shit out. Finally got my room back in my personal space, but y'all gonna see what's up, man. So for y'all asking, where's CJ at? Why he ain't making no videos? It's a lot been going on, man. I ain't even let y'all know, but if you follow my Instagram, you know, man, I'm in a shop now. I stopped cutting in my room. I got offered a part-time job at Air Wizards, one of my local barber shops. You know what I'm saying? One of the hottest shops in Philly, you know, tap in if you haven't already. But yeah, man, I'm actually working on getting my barber's license right now. So it's a it's a process, you know what I'm saying? And I'm about to show y'all what I got down here. I've been working on this too. So YouTube, it hasn't really been my number one priority, but I'm slowly trying to get back into it. Get my consistency back. Once I get that back, man, we're going to be dropping bangers, man. What I got planned for 2023, I'm just hoping all that go right. But I'm about to do this little unboxing for y'all, so y'all going to see what's up. Hi, Sheesh. Oh, y'all. Y'all, you about to see what this is. Oh, sick. Dang. Islecraft Rogue Clippers, man. Yo, one of my uh co-workers at my shop, he was telling me about these. He was like, yeah, bro, I like these, you know what I'm saying? Because I wanted to know, uh, figure out, like, a type of clipper to invest in. So I'm like, yeah, bro, I'm not really sure, like, what I should invest in. Should I grab these? He's like, yeah, bro, get these. They real nice. As you can see, they kind of, like, skinny, fit in the hand well. Come with all this shit. Also came it also came with a micro nose and ear trimmer, which is dope because a lot of my older clients when they come and shit like they be having hair in their ear and their nose. I'm like, yeah, I'm not trying to use my clipper for these my trimmer, so it's real good. Thank you, Stylecraft, for sending me these. Uh, so for the unboxing, uh, this color is crazy, man. I really wanted this color because I had the trimmer this color already. So like now that junk gonna match. That shit gonna be a cold combo right there. If y'all see me with these, just know, just know, this shit about to be crazy. This shit gonna get dice. These, these are Stylecraft trimmers too, and I just threw a DCL 2.0 blade on this. It's a little modification I did. Oh, I got a zero gap these. But it's a little mod I did on them, so they work good, bro. I like these. But yeah. I'm about to open these jaws. Feel how they feel. Ooh. Oh, I got the I got the click lever. And this on pretty tight. I might gotta loosen the screw a little bit. Damn. Okay. I can already see how these like how these beneficial as far as like flicking. Like it kinda got its own thumbprint. It's pretty tough. Ooh. Okay. These shows are a little these shows are a little crazy. But yeah, I'ma like these. I can already tell. These fire man, blacked out bleed, you know what I'm saying? Real crispy, crispy. What else in the box? I'm about to see what's else in the box. I'm pretty sure it come with like a charger and all that good stuff. Yep, what I say? Charger. Oh, they threw me some guards in there too, but oil nothing crazy all right y'all this the new setup man we came a long way if y'all remember i was in my bedroom you know what i'm saying now i got the basement so i really been rocking out here you know what i'm saying check this joint out dope little setup that's why i keep all my clippers got my shavers the new Jones, these gonna hit crazy. I'ma try and get a video of a haircut I do with them. These my old Jones, they stopped working as good. They don't work as good no more, so 
Gotta get these, man. These are good clippers. These, I made a video off of these, like, good starter clippers. These are great starter clippers, guys. Like, I threw a whole nother casing on it, so it don't look the same, but you see how I just turned it on and then turn on? You see? Look, it's on. Like, they're good, but, like, after a lot of use, they tend to die out. So, that's why I really grabbed these. You know, they gonna, they gonna make up for these. These in retirement right now. My man got no eyeball. See that you're missing. Yeah, got the Xbox. I had my boy PlayStation down here, but he he, he needed that drum back, so I got the TV and banging music. That drum be tough. Got my little Buddha cape, little tapestry. Right here is the exit. This painted tough, man. I gotta see what I'm gonna do with it. I'm planning on getting this wall fixed. I had just threw some. It's like a shower curtain. I just. You heard that? Bro, I need to get this wall fixed because that drone is dusty. But I put this here so it don't really get on nobody's clothes because of shit. Like, it's a work in progress, man. This is my little couch. But yeah, ain't much to it, man. The accessories, whatever I use, like, it's pretty much the same thing. Got my aftershave, Tresemme, my water bottle, some foam enhancements. I'm saying everything I'm saying a barber really needs in a station. Nothing too crazy, man. I do got a sink now, guys. So washing hair, that's another service I could add to my list. Um, if you cut hair, you know that it's very important to cut hair when it's clean. Like I suggest all my clients wash their hair before and after getting a cut because when you get a haircut, you don't want any trap dirt oils in your hair. You know what I'm saying? It's not going to help your line up. It's not going to help none of that. And for that reason, I do hot towels on a lot of my clients because the hot towels help clean off the skin. You know what I'm saying? There's other ways you could clean it off. But, like, when I use the barber saw, it leaves a really nice ash line, really nice and natural. So if you're not washing your client's hair... I probably suggest you do something to clean it off. For example, sea breeze is another really good idea. If you don't want to wash their hair and you about to line them up, just hit them with some sea breeze or alcohol. Clean it off real nice. Preparation is everything for the lineup. If you want it to come out clean, you got to prepare. I'm planning on making a video tomorrow on a haircut with these. So I'm going to show y'all what these are about. It's going to be crazy. We're going to be lit, dog. The next day. So this before the cut. Um, this is my man's Michael. This is his first time getting his cut by me. He ain't really know what he wanted to go with, but we decided to go with like a mid drop fee. He was thinking a taper at first, but we decided to go with an all around fee. Um, for the most part, I really like how these clippers cut. They're light. They're really easy to flick with, and they do well with debulking. I also like how they make a noise. Like when they cut the hair, you know when you're cutting the hair because it makes a noise. If I had to rate them, one from 10, probably an 8. I definitely recommend these clippers, man. Shout out to Style Card. The only downside I'll give to these clippers is probably the battery life. I think I cut like three heads and then they died on me. But other than that, dope clippers. And this after the cut, man. Let me know what y'all think about this joint. It's an all natural cut. This is the first time I cut his hair, so it was a little different for me. He wanted to taper the lineup. You know what I'm saying nice drop fade. Let me know what y'all think about this, John. But yeah, for the most part, that's the cut, man. I appreciate everybody for watching. Make sure y'all go subscribe, hit the notifications, man. I'm hoping to drop more frequently. Look, cut my man off guard with the business card. But I appreciate y'all again. Till next time, CJ out. Peace.